Bye Bye Bikini. With a tweet, Miss America scrapped its iconic swimsuit competition. And the judges must keep their minds strictly on the job. A beauty pageant that started almost 100 years ago as a tourist attraction in Atlantic City, New Jersey, evolved into what organizers now describe as a competition. Next seat. Miss America 1989 and former newscaster Gretchen Carlson became the first female chairwoman of the organization's board after derogatory and chauvinistic emails from a former CEO became public. We will no longer judge our candidates on their outward physical appearance. That's huge. The idea is to make the competition more inclusive to women of all shapes and sizes. Given the organization is the largest provider of scholarship assistance to young women in the United States, and its stated purpose is to promote their education. While some applauded the decision, not everyone is on board. I think it's a good thing. Yeah. 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 I mean, it should be based on their, you know, personality, their answers, what they want to do to help the world be better. I think it's ridiculous that they're not doing the swimsuit pageant. Why is that? Because it's part of it. It always has been for as long as it's been in existence. Well, suppose I'm supposed to say I'm in favor of uh, such a such a thing, but I uh, probably would be lying. The evening gown competition will also change to allow contestants to focus on personal style. Yeah, whatever they choose to do, it's going to be what comes out of their mouth mm. that we're interested in when they talk about their social impact initiative. The changes will take effect in the next competition, which is scheduled for September. Kristen Salumi, Al Jazeera.